Okay, so I just finished watching the first episode of Camp WWE, which was a joint venture by uh, Seth Green and the WWE. And I'll give you a quick synopsis. John Cena is homesick, not voiced by John Cena. Vince McMahon is like, well, we've got to stop him. Vince actually is the voice of Vince, which is nice. So he sends camp counselors, Triple H and Stephanie, to try to make him feel better? That doesn't work. And then Vince shows him a video that's like, hey, your home is going to explode and everyone's going to die. Okay. Ric Flair also tries to help John Cena not feel homesick by humping a pile of rocks. Humping a bear. And a tire swing. And then crying. I, I was trying to think of how this is funny. I'm a huge Robot Chicken fan, but that's like weird kitschy pop culture references where this is just Vince thinking that throwing a bunch of profanity in like one after another is actually funny and it's kinda like oh there are moments Triple H is after like all of your parents are dead it's like they're dead really and Taker has this weird kind of smile I'm like I'm like that that's good not voiced by Taker then you have Austin not well, all the kids not voiced by the actual wrestlers. It's like, oh, okay, so I got to hear Flair, and I got to hear Vince McMahon. Maybe this is just the first, like, you know, test the water sort of bit, but it's not funny. Not funny at all. They even do a black and white se sequence, which is very interesting about Beaver Cleavage, if you remember him. And it's just... It's an on-demand only thing, so you don't want kids to accidentally watch it. And I'll be honest, this is to the point where I don't think parents should accidentally watch. This is not good. At least we've got Edge and Correction, which 70% of the show is absolutely funny. This is just waste of time. 